Hello everybody and welcome back to what I got for Christmas series. I actually just realised how much I've actually got for Christmas to be honest so yeah. So today's video is all about homeware essentials or home item essentials. So I'm just going to be running through with you some of my bits that I got from like homeware. Okay, you may not think this is kind of like homeware essential but I got the loveliest Pajamas, oh gosh, upside down. Whoops. The loveliest pajamas you've ever seen. It's so cute. It says, set up your star watching camp, scan the horizon for wild bears. Midnight snack bought by dad at 7 pm. Warm socks are essential. Study the stars, snuggle up, discover new planets, and keep warm. It's so cute, and there is matching bottoms as well with little stars on them. Aren't they just the cutest thing you've ever seen in your life? Next off, we all know the emoji craze has gotten to us in the past few years and everything has been turned into emojis from phone cases to pillows. Well, I've started that craze and I've got the coolest socks you've ever seen in your life. I am so excited to wear these because look at them. They are so cool. I've been wanting something. As you all know, I am addicted to galaxy themed stuff. So like dresses, jumpers, bedding, bedding. I wanted a galaxy bedding for Christmas because I asked for a dress for my birthday and I didn't find one until a few months later on Wish. And we were looking for galaxy bedding and I didn't like all of them look great but I didn't find one that suited me until I came across this which I totally forgot about until Christmas day this is an awesome thing for your bed how cool is this let me give you a close up I absolutely love it and I haven't even put it on my bed yet it's so cool next is something I've seen a few times actually my mum's got one of these it's called the thankful diary this is basically a diary where it says it's a beautiful day and there's little phrases in the book as well but the main purpose is today um, I am thankful for and then you list a day and the reasons why you are thankful for that day it's so cute and at the beginning of the book it says when you first wake up and before you go to bed, take the time to think about what you are thankful for. Think positive and the rest will follow. This is, I believe, for a whole year. And look at the copper. Copper themed everything. It's so cute and I'm definitely going to fill this in. Next thing is this cute memo block. This is a desk calendar and note block for 2017. It's come off a little bit, but I can re glue that. This is the tiniest calendar I've ever seen in my life, and it's so cute. And then, if you lift the little roof up, you've got your very own cool memo block. Oh my gosh. It's so cute. When I first saw it, I was like, what is this? And then lifted the roof off, and I was like, oh. Next part is pretty much me. And to be honest with you, I kind of have to agree that this is one of the subjects where we can all relate on. Candles, definitely candles. This one is amazing. I actually got it for a friend and my mum bought it and I actually thought I was getting two because one of my um, art teachers got me something for Christmas and it was completely irrelevant. But this is a really nice candle in a little cup that smells really fresh. And I'm obsessed with copper right now, look at that lid. But on the front, it says in copper writing, be amazing. These are so cute. I knew I was getting them, by the way, but I couldn't resist. Copper candles, two of my most favorite things in the whole wide world. These are kind of like Aztec themed because of the little board that they're on. But look at how cute they are. Adorable. To go with the matching candle theme, Christmas tea lights. They are so cute. They've got different ones like Santa Claus, polar bears, Christmas trees. There is pretty much everything Christmassy about this candle set. And following up with the candle subject is this. A little house for, if you couldn't guess what, a candle. So you put the candle into your little house. You obviously light it before you put it in. 
and it's supposed to hang up somewhere. I'm not entirely sure where though. Hopefully on the ceiling or something. And then it's going to come out all the little holes and make your room look amazing. And finally, we all know that I love a good bunch of fairy lights. And who can't resist a good fairy light when it's 10 LED ones that look like flipping hearts? These are so cute. I love the pattern and I'm definitely, definitely going to be hanging these around my bed. Okay guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up, comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys!